Hey guys, welcome to a new game called uh, Hotel Dream. Um, apparently it starts up like this. I have to sign a contract. Okay. Uh, this contract is made between Hotel Dream and the Night Auditor applicant. I guess that's me. Uh, work environment precautions. Changes in biorhythm due to night shifts. All right. Possibility of unexpected situations. Sure. Intermittent errors in security system. All right. Applicants agreement. Risks associated with the work environment. Company exemption from liability for psychological and physical effects. That one might be a little a bit of a problem. Uh, maintaining confidentiality related to work. Sure. And understand, I understand and agree to above terms. Uh, John Doe? Sure. I wonder if I hit not do not sign. Oh, the game just closes. Okay. <laughs> Let's start that over. Okay, now we're back to this. This I'm just gonna sign it this time. Okay. Oh, there we go. Oh. Weird. How do I walk into it? There we go. Why do the walls look like flesh? Isn't it somebody gonna answer that phone? Or is that my job? Security. How do I... Oh, there we go. Okay, got it. Hello. Is this the person who contacted us recently? Maybe. First of all, welcome to the Dream Hotel family. Thank you. Well, you already know most of what's going on here, right? No, not at all, actually. Even if you don't, you've already signed the contract, so there's no going back. Okay. As you saw in the contract, you'll be working night shift from midnight to 6 a.m. All right. Today you'll need to handle any complaints that come into the office during the night shift. Sure. That's the basic job, and I assume you're well, well aware of it. Yeah. Oh, right. It was room 207. What was? That room should have just been vacated. Can you start by cleaning the room? Just go to room 207 now and tidy it up. All right, I'll leave it to you then. Okay. It seems to be an ordinary TV. The screen shows nothing. Empty drawer. Empty drawer. Okay. You don't need to worry about the fridge. You don't do anything about the fridge. An electric fan that will help you survive the hot summer. It creaks, but at least it's turning. No sound is coming out. Probably because it's off. Alright, so... 207. Can I use the elevator? I'm lazy like that. The elevator doors are firmly closed. There's no response when pressing the button. Okay, time to do some stairs. Get the cardio going. Alright, come on. It's flesh colored walls. Alright, 207. Are there any markers? Broken elevator. This is a lovely hotel. It's just a dream. Is it just a dream? All right, 204. Five. I would assume that would be six, but I don't think so. And seven, so that must be 208. Oh my God. What eggs? Trash scattered on the floor. That was a pineapple. Okay, bed. It's a bed. When you lie down, you 
feel every single spring. <laughs> Lovely bed that is. All right, can I not clean that crap up? I guess not. It seems I finished cleaning. Let's go back. Have I? There's bags of trash on the... Oh, I was like, that's a weird electrical system. Okay. There's bags of trash in front of the bed, and there's a bottle of something on the couch. Well, we're done, so we'll go. The refrigerator is empty. All right, cool. I hear the phone ringing again. Man, I don't get a moment's peace in this place. What is this room? Nothing. Wait a minute. Oh, yeah, this is right. I was like, wait, wasn't this turn that where the elevator was? Also, it was a really long hallway. Confuse me for a moment. All right, let's check this out. I want to see if I can... Uh... The elevator is half open. It doesn't seem usable. All right. Coming, coming. Give me a minute. Security. Close all the way. There you go. All right, please bring one drink to 203. Just there. 203. Where do I get a drink from? So I got a drink. Alright. Am I security or am I like concierge service or something? And why am I a maid too? Alright, so 203. That's not right. Will be the left. Yeah, there we go. Here's your soda, you freak. Thank you, just leave it there. I'll have to drink in the front of the room. Or, now let's go back to the office. Okay. Very tall seat. Ring, ring, ring. Now who is it? Is it my boss, or is it some one person that owns a bag of chips now? Whoa. Hey, the door to slap me back. That box. Oh, that was like a box of cigars. Okay. No sound can be heard. A book with the Dream Hotel manual written in it. Doors can be opened and closed by dragging. You think there'd be something you'd learn, you know, in the beginning? Or you open a door? It says. What does this mean? Remember series 302. It's too noisy. Go deal with it quickly. 302. Alright. Open. Four. Thank you. 302. Alright, let's check out 302. Oh, we got our uh, crap beat at us or something. Alright. <gasps> Okay. Okay. That's confusing. They're like shuffling. Did I hear like sawing for a moment there? For some reason, I can't hear the noise anymore. It seems to be resolved for now. Okay. A little weird. Okay. Oh, God, what are you? Okay. Whoa. Okay, I thought I saw something. Didn't. All right. Hello? 
One drink to 205. I took out a drink. Why is it dark now? Two oh five, I said, right? Yeah, I think it was two oh five. There's something different here. I really can't put my finger on it. Okay. Pot that someone brought. They don't seem to care. Let's just go back to the office. Am I dead? I went like right through me. Don't need to make a comment about that. Who cares? Weird crap happens all the time. Hey, something seems off here. You're... Yeah, you know what? Something does seem a little off here. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Come to 307 quickly now. Three oh seven, sure. Something seems off. There's my mannequin friend. What is that? Is that a mouse? What is that? I don't know. Go for so it should be this way. Five, six, and then seven. Hi. Okay. Um, all right, let's... Yeah. Something doesn't seem right. A uh, ketchup for your pizza. Hello? No, thank you. Sleeping. I said no, thank you. Sleeping. Okay. Hi. So very weird. Three oh two. Go to what? What three or two? You know, if I was this guy and I worked here, I think I probably would have already quit by now.
Oh, the red light. Red light is a good usually, right? Whoa. Huh. Oh. I hope this elevator works. Down, please. Faster. Faster. Close. Go faster. Close. Push button. What? Oh. Oh, down, down, down. The hell was that? Oh, yes. Hello. Is this the person who contacted us recently? First of all, welcome to the Dream Hotel family. Well, you already know most of what's going on here. I know nothing. Right? Hotel Dream. Weird. Um... Weird is the best way that I can put it. I mean, it was pretty good. It scared me a couple of times. You know, not like, you know, my, you know, really good screams. Like, but uh, it got me a few times there. Um, but yeah, that's Hotel Dream. Um, it, it's in a small window, and I'm going to have it sized up and everything for you, but it, pretty, it was a pretty good game. Check it out yourselves. It'll be down in the description. Let me know what you thought of it in the comments, and I'll catch you all in the next one. Thank you. Bye.